steps in, in breaking rhythm is going like slow and fast, right? So we're practicing a slow drill right now where we're both moving really slowly. We can do whatever we want. It's basically free play, but at a slow pace. So one of the things that I can do is I can actually use what I learned from slow play in, into full speed sparring, right? Um, because he's, if you built into a rhythm, he's gonna be able to predict it. So if I'm going as fast as I can in free play all the time, he knows at what speed, he learns what speed I can hit him at, but I can throw that off by throwing in slow cuts, right? So if I hit him with a fast cut, right? Now he knows what speed it's coming in. If suddenly after that I go for a slow cut, the chances are he's gonna parry, and then he's gonna realize it hasn't come yet, and as he drops, then I follow him in with a slow, with a slow cut, right? So you go for the parry, it's not coming, boom, right? But it was just a really, really slow cut. That's it, right? So fast one. And then I, I do the same thing, but then I hit him afterwards because a lot of times he'll drop his hands. Mm -hmm. okay? That's it. This is a good angle for me. But if you move your feet and re win the line, now we're both even. Yeah. 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 So when you cross your body too, you'll want to do the um, step, the passing step or whatever to align yourself, or like a, like a triangle. In and out, move side, side, move forward at an angle. Mess with me a little bit. And sometimes you're going to be able to catch me lacking this. You're okay. going to be able to catch me when I'm not paying attention to Right? Because suddenly we'll be at an angle that you predicted and I didn't know. Mm. Focus on not staring at his sword. Mm -hmm. Try not to look at his sword either. Like try to sp focus a little bit on looking through him. Mutieren! <laughs> 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 